Hi everyone, welcome back again. Uh, this time still uh, in Canary Island clusters. So we have uh, kind of uh, island tours on Tenerife, the main island here. As you can see, we have going to Mount Teide, Teide, and then also Santa Cruz, the Tenerife, and yeah, and we see all this Las Americas, Los Cristianos area of the tourism area here on the west side. So now we are moving into the second island, which is La Gomera. So all of these seven islands, Hill, El Hierro, La Palma, Gran Canaria, Fuerteventura and Lanzarote. There's a actually Graciosa, I think, island here. A small island there. But anyway, this seven island has been... Uh, I put a add-on, which is created by Island Creations. Very nice, uh, very accurate uh, textures. And combined with Tabure 5 meter dam, it gave us a very accurate, almost accurate kind of... Uh, kind of yeah so geographical situations in the in each, each of the island so this is the second island that we're going to visit which is we're going to fly from Reina Sofia or the Tenerife Sur the southern part of the Tenerife airport and then we're going to fly to La Gomera it's only about 21 minutes we're going to use uh, Cessna 208B Grand Caravan going to bring around 10 passenger or 9 passengers uh, chartered flight from uh, Tenerife to La Gomera. From there we're going to try to do a quick circle in um, La Gomera. This is a very smaller island so we can probably do a quick uh, tour uh, once we landed in La Gomera. So this is a morning flight so we can take a uh, Wait on an afternoon flight for uh, for seeing the island. Okay, so let's go. Okay, so we are now ready to uh, prepare our aircraft. So we're gonna fly Cessna Grand Caravan to 8B. So from uh, Reina Sofia or Tenerife Shur. Uh, so this is uh, livery from Flight Sim.2, Inter Canary Island. Anyway, basically. So let's prepare the aircraft. So I'm going to fly alone uh, without uh, any, you know, co pilot. Let's uh, set up this first. Okay. I think that's it. Up is off. Gear down, no problem. There's no gear up actually. Can try to turn the fuel cutoff switch. And we switch on the, the battery here. Okay. Uh and oops sorry. Okay, switch off master three. We can, I think, switch on the victory number two first. Is okay, and then let's do this fuel pump to normal, uh, and then generator. Okay, on ignition on. Let's. Uh, Navigation on, beacon and strobe on, because we're going to start the engine. Let's start the engine. It's ramping up. The N2. With the turbo prop. Okay. Okay, I think it's ramping up. Let's 
stabilize there. We can turn off the switch here to off. Start the switch and that's it. I think we're gonna do clearance. Reina Sophia clearance delivery Binter 645 heavy ready to copy IFR clearance to log on era. Winter 645 Heavy is cleared to log on Airport as filed. Take off runway 7 climb and maintain 3,000 feet. Departure frequency is 119.3 clock 5464. Winter 645 Heavy cleared to log on Airport as filed. Take off runway 7 climb and maintain 3,000 feet. 3, 3, Departure on 119.3 clock 5464. Winter 645, heavy read back is correct. Contact ground on 121.9 when ready to taxi. Good day. Okay. Set. Uh, I think we can set later on. Uh, we can try to switch on altitude, right? Not sure. Yeah, I think it's supposed to. So altitude 3000 Rank 3 we can do it later on So it's roll pitch first and then we're gonna set the altitude to 3000 And yep And then we can try to go up to 3000 uh, Anything else? I think that's it And we can try to ask Oh, the passengers, let's get them on board. Uh, uh, those are the passengers. Uh, eight of them. And I think there's uh, three of them actually in the back. So almost like, uh, yeah, 11 people or at least 10 people. Okay, so we are ready. Got a taxi on. That's a first taxi. Raina Sophia Ground, Binter 645 Heavy with Oscar ready to taxi IFR. Binter 645 Heavy Taxi, to and halt short of runway 7 using taxiway Tango Bravo 1. Contact tower on 119 or decimal 0 when ready. Taxi to and hold short runway 7 using taxiway Tango Bravo 1, Binter 645 Heavy. Okay, so break off and let's... Uh, wait a minute, uh, let me put this into maximum. Okay, so today is a bit quiet here. So I put a standard version of the island creation textures for a 1080 but I put the premium one or the higher quality one on Nagomera. Because we're going to be there, so we are leaving Tenerife. We've done our uh, island tour with uh, my previous video. So, yeah, so now we are actually moving to La Gomera Island. The passengers will stay for a, a night over there and I think this is early morning, so we can have uh, an island tour from there on. 
and then uh, tomorrow morning uh, they're gonna leave again with this chartered flight into La Palma Island up north and uh, west north from La Gomera northwest okay so we are going to the end of the runway from here checking the flight control Gonna take the first uh, entrance to runway zero seven. Runway seven. We set our flight plan already. It's a direct flight anyway. So using GPS. Nothing fancy, no ILS, no, nothing. Uh, and there's no ILS in La Gomera anyway, so. Gonna be PR, PFR landing there. Oh, yes, I forgot to switch this on. Gonna hold short here. So it's kind of like this pad is descending into the runway, right? <laughs> okay, so into tower, request takeoff. Tower Binter 645 Heavy ready for departure runway 7 IFR to La Gomera. Binter 645 Heavy altimeter 29 or decimal 9 or 4 wind 316 at 12. Cleared for takeoff runway 7. Cleared for takeoff runway 7 Binter 645 Heavy. Okay, so our roll off the takeoff speed is around 70 knots, so. That and our climbs effective climbs we did on 110. So we're gonna use a bit of lap. It's one step. It's a uh, going down like this. The runway is I don't know is true or not, but that is very steep. <laughs> kind of. Uh, Decline over there. Okay. Okay. So we are line up with runway now. Okay. Let's take off. Spearing to the left. I need to put a bit of right rudder here. Almost 70, so we can roll up. Okay, trying to stay on the, the this runway first until we clear the runway. I think that's the rule. We're gonna climb. Six four five heavy contact in area center on one one nine or decimal tree. Good day. Go 
Going to 119er decimal tree Vintar 645 heavy. Canaries Center Vintar 645 heavy is at 1,100 feet, climbing 3,000 feet. Vintar 645 heavy, Canaries Center altimeter, 29er decimal niner 4, continue as planned. Vintar 645, heavy your tree, 6 miles east. Maintain present heading and altitude. Expect vectors visual runway 27 approach. Maintain present heading and altitude. Expect vectors visual runway 27 approach. Vintar 645 heavy. We're going to turn now toward our navigations uh, pad. And there's a runway on below. There's a runway. So we are heading to that island in the background, La Gomera. So now we're going to activate our autopilot here and navigations so the aircraft will follow the navigation point now and we are going to select uh, altitude mode here so we're gonna increase to 3000 and let's do uh, VS this time so we're gonna put our climb uh, rate uh, around 800 since we can do 1000 feet per minute That's Los Abrigos uh, below us. So we almost reach 3,000 now. It will then uh, hold altitude at 3,000, I hope. Gonna speed up a bit around 130, I guess. Yep. Okay, so we are at 130 knots. That is below us, Los Cristianos. So now we say goodbye to Mount Ada. That is Las America speech, just far ahead. So we have covered that in a previous video about Tenerife using helicopters to go around this, uh, this island. So now we are heading to La Gomera Island in front of us. So it's a very short hop. 
Probably run 20 minutes only. The weather is always nice, I guess, in Tenerife. Almost like this is live weather. Uh, yeah, it's. I think it's like 16 days a year, rainy. Uh, 16 day, rainy days a year uh, in Canary Islands. So, yeah, there's a uh, there's a boat below us. So we I'm using also um, uh, Fessel AI from Fessel Simulations. Yeah, that's that's a sailing sailboat, and there's a ferry or some speedboat over there. Very nice. Any other boats going around here? No. Yeah, so there's a sailboat. Uh, two of them, two two sailboat actually, and one uh, speedboat over there. So that another sailboat. I think that's a catamaran type, yeah, dual hull uh, boat. That's a speedboat one of these, very fast moving. Okay. Um. Yeah. Yes. Still, not sure how many miles. This thing is quite far away. I think we're gonna land up uh, on the left side here. Somewhere here, actually. Yeah. It's actually La Gomera Airport. Heavy contact. Rain and Sophia approach on Good day. 127 decimal 7 for Binter 645 Heavy. Reina Sophia approach Binter 645 Heavy, 3000 feet. Binter 645 Heavy, Reina Sophia approach altimeter 29 decimal 9 for continue as planned. Okay, so look like this. So we can have like a more uh Is La Gomera Island in front of us? Uh, La Gomera Island, I think there's uh, not have many kind of uh, tourism spot, but there are beaches around. But there's a there are also high cliff uh, beach front. Uh, like it's very um, yeah, it's very hard, rough terrain. But yeah. It'll be interesting to see and from the look at it is there's a lot of kind of uh, lava low kind of uh, valley several valley I guess over there and um, it's probably we can just going around the island at one go and in one video so that's it Oh, we forgot to put the taxi light off. Even the landing light not on, so don't forget to switch it on for landing. And anyway, it's probably no needed, but because it's so bright. Four five heavy descent and maintain two thousand seven hundred feet. Two thousand seven. That's, that's very just quite a small difference. Two thousand seven hundred feet. 
it with the VS here. Oops, sorry. Okay. Ah, uh, Azure is off again. Damn it. Not sure why. Two seven. I think it's already capturing the altitude hold again for 2700. It is sand maintained. It is an okay. Some glitch uh, happening just now uh, for Azure, unfortunately. The airport in front of us. The La Gomera Airport sector. Uh, Maintain present heading and altitude. Venter six four five heavy. Uh, La Gomera Airport sector on top of a cliff. So it's very interesting. Uh, airport it might be one of the difficult one, but I hope uh, I hope we can land over there. There's some glitch on the textures over there. Seems to. Where's the airport? I think you're 11. I think that's the airport over there. Over here, if not mistaken. Yep. We are going to come in a bit straight, so yeah, interesting. Or oh, actually over here, there's the airport, yeah, right there. So if if we miss uh, the the breaking point, it we're gonna go over the cliff, <laughs> basically. Where is it? Can you see it? My first time landing in La Gomera, so. I can see the airport. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be up there. It's supposed to be up here. Or this one is the airport. Ah, oh, yeah, that's the one. Okay, so let's do AP off. Was very dangerous, right? Winter six four five 
I copy, but I need to land here. Maintain 2,700 feet, Binter 645 Heavy. Binter 645 Heavy Airport is 2 miles at your 11 o'clock. Maintain present heading and altitude report runway in sight. Maintain runway present tight. heading and altitude, Binter 645 Heavy. I don't know. A bit too steep. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> That's not good. Winter 645 Heavy, you are one mile east. Maintain present heading and altitude. Expect vectors visual runway 27 approach. I really land. Two seven is. I think there's something wrong with the ATC, right? I mean. Maintain present heading and altitude. Expect vectors visual runway two seven approach. Binter six four two seven heavy. approach. You are not. Shit. That was like uh. You know that was really kind of uh. Very short. Runway uh approach actually. I think they make a mistake on doing that, right? Not sure about that. Anyway, I've landed already. So it's not a very nice landing. Just I need to do a bit of like a very steep approach. Traffic Venter 645 Heavy is taxiing to runway Niner. I'm not trying. Where is the Where is the parking area? It's over there on the left. The passenger must be very scared of me. <laughs> That's just a very steep uh, approach. Uh, I think I should have uh, like descend earlier rather than later. I think uh, TC just give us a bit wrong directions, and suddenly we have to approach. Runway 27, where we already pass it. That's not a good idea. Oops, where is it? Not this one. It's not for the aircraft, that's for the car. Yep, car. It's in front of us. That's a taxiway to parking area. So that is La Gomera Airport. Unfortunately, ATC is not doing a very good job, I guess, in terms of uh, helping us land. This is first time I land, so I don't know. Even I cannot see the airport, so yeah. Fortunately, we can just save the flight <laughs> rather than going around. I know it's probably we should have go around first rather than trying to land. 
So that's La Gomera main uh, departure and arrival hall. Very nice. Okay, so that's it. So we and it's to land in La Gomera and. That's the thing we do, engine cut off here. Okay. Oops, sorry, this is off. This is normal. Uh, Fionic off. Off. It's off, off. And battery off. Okay guys, that's the... Uh, oops, yep, that's La Gomera. Let's go in uh, for a uh, rifle in La Gomera, I guess. Walk here. Mm -mm. It's supposed to be a gate here. Where is it? Sure. Of this here is the exit. It gets claim, yep. There you go. So this is the that's the exit I guess. Yep, that's the other way around. Let's go to the toilet first. <laughs> I need to go to the toilet. Oh, it's locked. Okay, so here it goes. Uh, that's somebody already picked me up. I get okay so we are this is the main hall and we're going out here that's our bus yeah okay so this is the bus so we're gonna be in the hotel for a while and check in and then we are ready for our island tour uh, uh, this afternoon okay see you around mm -hmm. 